we are assembling um, the apple bushel box card. Okay, so I have already glued this panel on because I was just gluing these two pieces together and put it on the wrong one. So, so I've already glued my pieces there, my circles for my sentiment are on the back. Now these handles, you just want to fold them down. I went ahead and put a handle on the back. Um, I don't know. I thought it looked okay that way. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to fold these score lines. I'm not going to fold my handle down yet because I'm going to put these pieces on my basket. And you have two that fit the basket straight up and down. And you just kind of want to just use your own judgment where to put those. I think they look pretty good right there. And then you have this piece here that goes straight across the top. one you can see the notches where this piece fits okay so just like that then you can fold your handle down and there is a, um, a small piece to put here on the on the handle. You if you leave the handle up, um, it won't fit in an envelope. So you do have to fold that down. There's a little flower to put on the front of your card but I'm gonna wait to glue it on because I want I want to um, and I'm just gonna pinch a little crease here in the leaf just to give it a little more dimension but I I want to pop this up with some foam tape so I'm not gonna put this on yet just going to put it together. Okay, so that's the front and the, and the back. We can go ahead and put these two pieces together. set those aside and now let's pull in our apples. I tried to make um, to make it as easy as possible to put these together. Uh, there is a leaf for every apple. You don't have to put it on every apple if you don't want to. Um, that's just a preference, whichever way you like it. So 
So you put down the long piece and then the center one is the one. I'm going to pop up my center one with some foam tape. So the longest part is going to be putting on all these little leaves if you want them. I think it's nice to add um, some other color because it's a lot of red and a lot of brown. And so I just put the glue just on the tip there of the leaf. You don't need a whole lot to hold it on. Hopefully I was able to push that one down enough. So it's not too long putting these on. Like that went pretty quick. So let's set that one aside and do this next one. It's the same concept. So if you wanted different colored apples, you'd have to make them. Now, if you want to put on an individual apple on each spot. These are all the same size, so you could just cut extras of these to put on in here. That would work. Oh, I do want to use foam tape on these too, so I'm going to put my leaves on first. These are foam squares that I get at Dollar Tree. It's a dollar twenty-five tree here now. But a dollar twenty-five if you've ever bought foam tape, you know, for a roll of foam squares, a dollar twenty-five is a good price. So it's every other apple, just like that. Okay, now let's put on our back leaves. Okay, very quick and simple. Now we're going to bring in the card base. And just like I do on all of my other cards, I'm going to lay this down flat inside and I'm going to glue it here to the tab. You just want to be careful with it till you get it together because you don't want to tear this section here that holds the card together. And then we're going to do the same thing with this piece. We're going to lay it on top of this one and bring this over. Now, okay, let me pull this off because this is not lined up the way I like. There we go. So 
see if I have to put more glue on that or not. Nope, I think it's going to hold. This has got a much smaller area here for gluing. So put glue on each tab and not too much. You don't want it to go over. And we're going to leave this side down flat and bring our other side over. And I've got to kind of stretch my paper because I have my foam squares in here already. And fold it the other way as well. And then we're going to close it up. Okay, let's take a look. And I'm going to add a foam square. I've got a half one here I'm going to use. Just gonna put this here on the bottom corner and there is our apple bushel box card thank you for joining me